Thanks for joining the One Screen channel. Today, we're going to discuss One Screen Canvas. One Screen Canvas is the video collaboration workhorse in our lineup, and it's built for the hardest working conference, huddle, and training rooms. Let's jump into our hardware and software. Now, all of our One Screen Canvas touchscreens come standard with the original LG IPS LED panel. Additionally, they all come standard with the heavy duty thick anti glare glass surfaces, 4K resolution, and 20 points of touch. Moving up to the camera, we have a webcam that has a powerful microphone, wide angle lens, and a customized shelf that can mount right here to the top. Additionally, we have our onboard computer, and it's an Intel i7 fourth generation processor with eight gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of solid state drive with the Windows 10 professional operating system. Now, moving down to the bottom, it also has a wireless keyboard with a mouse trackpad that allows you to wirelessly walk around the room and control the computer as well as the Android platform. There's also a customized shelf that it comes with for easy storage when not in use. There's a couple of dummy stylus pins that come with this guy as well. There's no uh, batteries or, or any electronics built into them, so you don't have to worry about losing them or breaking them, but it's a great utensil to use on the screen when you want to mouse and, and draw around. There's also two front-facing 15-watt Dolby speakers that come standard with this guy. And with the flick of a finger, I'm easily able to hit our home button to get directly to the navigation screen on our monitor. Right here, you'll see we have three HDMI inputs, VGA and DisplayPort inputs, and I can click on our apps area to access our Android 6 operating system, which includes our full-fledged Google Play Store, YouTube, built-in whiteboarding tool, Chrome, and even our eShare product that allows you to stream wirelessly directly from devices in the room in a bring-your-own-device scenario. Now, another cl quick click of the finger allows me to get right back into our Windows world. Now, this is where we're going to take advantage of our one screen annotate software. This is where it allows you to annotate over any document at any time during your presentations or brainstorming applications. So I brought up a PowerPoint. I can click on the beginning. Now, by clicking on my annotation tool, this allows me to actually draw directly on top of this PowerPoint. It doesn't matter if it's a YouTube video, a PowerPoint, an Excel sheet, a Word doc, you can annotate on anything and everything that's on your computer. I can also transition into a whiteboarding screen. In this case, I'm gonna grab my annotation tool just because it helps me write while I'm on the screen. And I can take my notes, I can brainstorm, I can flowchart. I am gonna show off a couple of specialized tools here. There's a scrolling tool that allows me to create more space in my whiteboarding world. There's a text pen that allows me to write something in my own handwriting, have it converted to text automatically. There's an intelligent pen. This is great for flow charting or when you're mocking up other documents to get things nice and clean. Everything is something that could be moved and reshaped and resized. I also have the ability to access our gallery area over here for Google image searches. By typing in one screen, I can do a search on the one screen line and see what images pop up. And I can easily drag and drop those right onto the screen for additional presentation purposes. I can put any word in there that I want to and Google Images will come up with something that I can use in my presentation. Additionally, there's also a dual annotation capability so you can have multiple people annotating. I can record everything that's happening on the screen and I have the ability to crop any information from another document. Lastly, I do have the ability to save all my information. As you're working, everything's saving within the software, I can then turn them into PDFs, JPEGs, bitmaps for sharing later, whether I want to email it, put it on a thumb drive, or send it to a network folder. I can also save within the file format of the software as a .yar file that allows me to come back and revisit the information to make any edits or addition as well. We basically consider this a living document application. And transitioning from our one screen annotate software, we're gonna jump directly into one screen hype. This is our video collaboration software that allows you to communicate with up to 50 participants at one time, anywhere in the world. You can do this via smartphone, tablet, Chromebook, laptop, or desktop. As long as you have some kind of microphone and speaker and camera, you'll be good to go. So right now we actually have this opened up in Chrome because it's a WebRTC based platform. However, you can always download it directly onto your desktop if you prefer to do it that way. Now, simply put, we have an easy layout. If I wanna communicate with someone ad hoc, I can click on the video link or I can just do a quick instant message with them or even call them audio wise. If I want to, I have the ability to start a multi-point call where I can bring in multiple people that are in my one screen hype world or even people that aren't by entering their email address. And I can also schedule it for a later date and time. Very easy, very one-touch application. Now, let's go ahead and jump into a three-point call. So right now, I have two colleagues on the line, and what I wanna show here is all the different facets that make one screen hype stand out from the rest. So for instance, I have a one-click touch application here. Again, even during the call, I can bring in people from outside right into the call with us. 
specific to one screen no one else offers is the ability to put in a phone number right here and dial directly out to someone's cell phone or landline. Again, that's something specific to one screen. Everybody, including one screen, has the ability to call into a number and type in a meeting idea to join as an audio conference, but we can also call out. There's a built-in whiteboarding tool that you can use for collaboration during your call. You can change the different layouts of the screen. Something specific to one screen, again, is with one screen hype, you can actually poll. I can type in questions and answers and have the remote participants answer on their side and I'll aggregate all that information. I can even have a built up PowerPoint and share that so they can answer the questions from a PowerPoint if I wanted to. So there's a lot of flexibility there. I can add multiple cameras, as many cameras as I like. I can also do a screen sharing capability which allows me to share my whole desktop or just a specific application. And in doing so, once I have shared my screen, I then have the ability to pass control to the far end for additional collaboration. Maybe we're working on some sort of Excel sheet or a whiteboarding document that we want to go ahead and collaborate on. I can easily do so. Lastly, we also have the ability to record. I can either record directly to the cloud or to the computer as a WebM file that can be shared with other participants outside of One Screen Hype just by putting the link right into the browser. I'm going to go ahead and hang up here. Thanks, guys. So there you go. A quick review on One Screen Canvas, the highest quality plug and play smart screen on the market. Thanks for joining us.